Well, hello everyone, it's day 11 of Vlogmas. Wow, isn't it going quick? It'll soon be Christmas before we know it. We've only got like, what, another 14 days to go? Wow. Well, I got another hospital appointment today. I've got to go and see the astronauts and the consultant, so that's going to be the best part of my day. So I'll take you with me, but you can't go into the hospital because no filming is permitted in there. You can take photographs of your babies when you've had them, but not when you're just going for a visit. But I will take you with me because my mum and dad have finished their Christmas decorations, so I want to show you those. So I've just got to go and clear the remnants of the snow off of my car. Oh, the joys. And then I'm heading off down to my mum and dad, so I will see you in a bit. This is the view in my car. I'm just running the engine to get it all off and uh, but my dad's gonna come and get me because it's quite icy and I yeah uh, it's gonna take a while I just gotta get my notes and then we'll be on our way so this is what the car looks like from the outside so as you can see it's not a lot of snow on here but I'm gonna try and get it off because I need the car tomorrow anyway while I'm waiting for my dad so yeah not a lot of snow left. Is there Rose? You look a bit lost, sweetie. My pretty girl. Who's bed? Hold out here, Rosie. <gasps> it's another Christmas tree. It's all sparkly. Hang on. Really now. <laughs> I can see that. Yeah, it's all right. Space of presents underneath it. <laughs> Yeah, it's lovely. With big smiles on their face. Lovely Christmas Don't tree. Put the lights back on now, Mum. What do you think about that, Rose? Hey. Oh, you pretty girl. Oh, it's a lovely rose bird. So, yeah, as you saw, you saw my parents' Christmas tree, it looks lovely. I've got my lights on my tree, I've got the heating on, I'm all snuggled up, I'm home from the hospital, everything is fine. Um, usual things, I've got to go back in a few weeks' time, but that's normal, especially at this stage. I am now going to have, excuse me, a nice hot drink. There's something to eat before Paul gets in, before we have proper dinner, because I haven't had any lunch. Um, I'm going to do some colouring in a bit. I'm going to colour in... Tina Nolog by Edwina McNamee. I've picked a page out. I know which one I'm going to do, so you'll be seeing my updates on that. I'm going to use my Touch 5 markers on that, so it's not going to take very long. I'm also going to start reading, or rereading, because I've actually read it once, uh, Rivers of London by Ben Aranovich this evening, because I fancy something fiction. I've got three non fiction books on the go, so I need a bit of fiction in my life, so. Uh, I, I did, I've read this book, I think it's a fantastic book, so I, I picked up a copy in Watson's the last time I was there. So I'm just going to curl up and read that now. So um, I'll show you what I've done in the uh, Tunanolog when I've done a bit, so you can see it. But like I said, I'm going to use my five, Touch 5 marker, so it probably won't take very long. And I will see you in a little bit, so I'm quite tired now. But I'm okay. I love Christmas. I've got a lot of shopping to do in the next few weeks. It's not Christmas related as well, but it is baby related, which is fine. Um, so I will keep you posted on that. I've just been sorting out some of her stuff because I want to wash all her, the, the, the clothes we've got her before she arrives. So, oh, and she's kicking again. Uh, but um, I plan on doing a bit of shopping um, soon for some more sleeping suits. And uh, she needs a couple of hats. What else do we need? What else does she need? Um, some socks. Just some stuff to keep her little toes and little fingers warm. So I got some stuff that was given to me already. So I'm just going to go and buy a few bits and pieces and buy some bigger stuff. So she's got something to grow into as well. So that's my plan for the next week or so. I'll be back soon and I'll show you how I'm getting on with Tin and Oleg. Hey, so it's been a long evening. Paul's oh, train was delayed, very late. 
um, due to an incident involving a lorry and a railway bridge. So he was over an hour late home. So we've had some dinner. Um, he's gone off to bed now because he's tired. And I'm just sitting here watching uh, TV about the Blitz and the bombs that changed Britain, which is on BBC Two last episode this Thursday coming. And that's set, uh, about my hometown, which is Bristol. So I'm looking forward to, well, I don't know about looking forward to, I think that's the wrong word, but I think it's going to be very interesting. Um, so I have done a bit of colouring in my tin and olive. And this is how it's looking so far. So very pretty. Um, obviously, I'm going to fill that up with stickles when I finish it. So I'm just going to sit here and watch the end of this program before heading off to bed. So very, very short vlogs today now. Not very exciting. But um, I will see you very, very soon. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow we might do a bit of a discussion. I know that... Um, some people have been discussing the problems with booktube or the pressures of booktube and um, also about whether or not you should edit your videos and use cut editing and things like that. So maybe we'll have a quick chat about that because that's quite an interesting one. So I'll uh, see you tomorrow. Bye!